guys today is a first day um it's actually midday this morning i got ready really quickly because i woke up a little bit late and i had to wash my hair because my hair was like four days old and i hadn't wa washed it and um, basically me and aiden went to santa's grotto today it was so cute he got to make like a little elf hat and also he got to meet santa which was really sweet and yeah we um had fun and then i dropped him off at nursery and i'm now home i'm just gonna do some work and do some bits and bobs tidying housework and stuff like that and i thought i'd quickly show you some parcels that came in and also um a lot of you guys have been asking me about my eyelashes um these are the ones that i've been wearing for the past two weeks i guess and I don't actually have the packaging anymore so I can't show you but these are from Savers yes guys Savers these were £1.99 some of my uh, favourite lash ever like just a few that I always buy and I always go back to and I think that these are going to be those kind of lashes that I always buy and go back to as long as I have them in stock I'm not sure if they are one off so whether they always have them in stock because i went into savers to buy um if you follow mrs hinch on instagram she does all of the like cleaning stuff and she's basically gone viral i've mentioned her before but i always follow her so whatever she buys or whatever i see her using and it works i go and buy it and a lot of the stuff is from b and b and is it b and m uh home bargains b and m or b and h stores and savers so whenever i drive past one i always pop in to see what i can find um some of the, some of the cleaning stuff is amazing and especially the pink stuff from savers this little pink pot of paste it's actually gotten rid of so many marks in my bathroom that i couldn't get rid of and with that pink paste which was 99p they've actually gone so i'm so grateful for mrs hinch because <laughs> she's helped me a lot in the cleaning department but whilst i was in there i saw eyelashes and i saw quite a lot they have a big selection so i thought i'd buy some and try and they're actually really good £1.99 guys for these so i'm gonna go back and buy some more um, maybe later today if I have time uh, before I pick up Aiden and I'll take you guys with me just to quickly show you this is the hat that he made when we went to the Santa Squatter there was like a little elf workshop and he got to make his own hat with stickers and it's got like a little bell on and then this is the present from Santa it's actually quite decent I'm actually quite impressed this is something that I would have bought him for Christmas like as a little stocking filler but he actually got it from Santa so that's really cool and he also gave us a real Christmas tree it's like a mini one so you can plant it and um, he said that it does grow into a full-size Christmas tree if you plant it in the garden but obviously I don't have one so I'm gonna put it in a like a little plant pot and also when I was at nursery I picked up this this is what Aiden made last month um, it's basically a little plate with his handprint on and I was like oh that is so cute and yeah um it's ceramic so I'm not sure if he's gonna be using it yet maybe when he's a little bit older but it's such a nice little thoughtful gift from the nursery well not gift because I had to pay for it but obviously it's like a nice keepsake for him and it's got the size of his handprint so yeah that's really cute I really like that actually manager also sent me a little Christmas present and it's a diptyque Christmas candle this smells so nice as soon as I opened the packaging um, well the parcel packaging I could smell it I can smell it now it's like so strong and so nice I am so grateful so thank you Hannah and my management team it's such a nice little gift and really useful as well and there's also a little Christmas card from them as well and from Cult Beauty I actually ordered this makeup bag it's a see-through one so I can see all of my makeup so it's really handy and I think it's gonna uh, be good for traveling it's like the perfect size I do have a Muji one which is a little bit too big for traveling um, so I thought I'd order this one and they were doing a 15% off discount code so I got it for about £15 and it just says cult beauty at the back and it's got like a little gold zipper it really reminds me of the Anya Him match ones I'm not sure if I'm saying that right probably just butchered her brand but 
yeah, it really, really reminds me of those ones. And I also picked up a Becca little highlighter. I uh, got this again for discounted price because it was doing 15% off. This is Moonstone. And I bought a little one because honestly, I never get through an, an entire highlighter. So I thought there's no point in buying a big one. I bought a little mini one instead and this is going to be good for travelling as well. Also, this came through the purse. It's the Benefit Eyebrow Kit from Anna Sakurni and I love the Sakurni Jewelies. I always watch their vlogs. Well, not every single day, but I watch the majority of them. Sometimes I just binge watch and I've been watching them for years. So I'm so happy that she's done a collaboration with Benefit. Like, it's so well deserved. She's an amazing mother. So basically inside, when you open it, there's a mirror there, which is really handy. There's a little postcard and there's a dog, one of her dogs. And there's this um, eyebrow kit. So you get two eyebrow pencils, a little spoolie, a high brow, a brow tones and a brow powder. So yay! That's really handy and I love Benefit eyebrow products. Like honestly, their eyebrow game is so strong right now. I just quickly wanted to show you this jumper that I'm wearing from H&M. I love it so much. I got it for um 20% off when they were doing black friday um but originally it's only 17.99 anyway so it's already like quite a bargain but the cutting is just so nice i was so surprised when i put it on i think i'm gonna actually go back and get some more colors and basically it's this black jumper and it's got this line down the middle but the cutting of it just actually makes me look really slim. It's an oversized jumper. For some reason, the cutting is just so nice. It's really like, I don't know, it just, it's not too oversized, but it's a nice fit. And the sleeves are baggy. It's got a really nice v-neck, which comes down to a really nice point, actually. It's not too low and it's not too high. And it's perfect for little necklaces like this. And yeah, it's just, it actually makes me look slimmer for some reason and I don't know why even though it's an oversized jumper it's just really flattering and I'm just wearing it with my Topshop journeys which have faded a lot like Topshop journeys are so comfy and hands down one of my favorite pairs of jeans but they just fade so quickly these were meant to be black and now they're like a charcoal color but anyways I paired it with this black jumper and yeah this black jumper is just really really nice i'm in service now and this is literally cleaning heaven i do need some washing up liquid and i also need some new flash as well um flash i use this one the one with bleach lots of good old saflora um i think i have them all so i'm not gonna buy any more saflora I'm gonna control myself. So this is the eyelash collection in Savers. There's actually a lot of eyelashes. And the ones that I have on right now are these ones. They're $1.99 and they're called Girls of Attitude Double Take English Rose Collection. These are the ones that I have on right now. And I also have these ones as well, which I wear now and again, which are $2.99 and these are called Perfect 10. Um, texture lashes they're really like fluttering full so I've just got back into my car I went to service and I showed you guys the eyelashes that I buy and when I was paying for my stuff the girl at the tail actually said to me oh I like really like your eyelashes like which eyelashes are you wearing and I was like it's just these like one pound 99 from servers and she was like i was like do you get a staff discount because then you can get it for even cheaper and she was like no we don't get a staff discount but i'm gonna check them out i'm gonna get some today <laughs> so i was like okay cool uh one pound 99 guys like honestly and the quality is actually really decent um i think that some of the cheaper lashes you can feel that they're cheaper and they just look a lot cheaper as well because they look a little bit shiny and a little bit more plastic but these are actually really good quality like I would compare these to Ilya, Ardell, all those kind of brands like there's not much difference honestly and I I just think it's a really nice eyelash I also got some cotton pads because 
you know, you can never get enough cotton pads, cotton buds. You can never have enough cotton buds and I've actually run out so I don't have any right now. I've got some honey and lemon menthol um, sweets for my car. Uh, my car is currently sweetless because I've had them all and I haven't restocked my little stash. I feel, I feel like everyone's car has a little stash of coins or sweets or some kind of junk and mine is um, these kind of mints so I'll pop that in my little box I also got um, some fire kill this is for my shower screen I feel like only full strength lime scale removers work on my shower because I live in a very hard water area even if I clean it and it's like sparkly and clean and see through like spotless with just one shower the lime scale builds up again and then it, it's just too much so I need to use a really strong strong one and I also got my trusty flash with bleach so naughty me i have an hour and a half to spare so i need to do some grocery shopping and uh have some food before i go pick up aiden from nursery but i drove past mcdonald's and i really fancied chicken nugget and chips so i was like okay i'll be good i'll just get a happy meal you know it's only small like you only get four chicken nuggets and a little bit of chips and i'll give the toy to aiden then when I was at the drive through I looked at the menu and I saw the chicken big tasty and I was just like oh my gosh that actually looks really good I honestly haven't had a McDonald's burger in years like I'm literally saying years because when I go to McDonald's I always order chicken nuggets or chicken selects I don't order um, a burger um, I don't know why I used to love filler of fishes and also the my chicken sandwiches I always used to get those but maybe about three years now I haven't had a burger like a proper burger burger so I saw it and I was just like you know what it's December I'm eating a lot anyways I'm gonna get fat anyways <laughs> like let's just do it so I got a chicken big tasty I've never had a original big tasty which is the beef one but this chicken one just looked really good and i was just like oh i just really need to try it <laughs> so here i am sat in my car about to enjoy this big tasty and let's oh it is oh it's square it's like a square shape it's not even round and it's pretty big look at all of that lettuce i love it when um, the burgers are full of lettuce. I hate it when they are really stingy with the lettuce. Oh, this looks really good. And it looks like it's a burger with two chicken selects in. And that's what drew me in because I obviously love chicken selects. So I'm going to see how good this is. Mmm. Mmm. This is actually really, really good. Mm. one of the best burgers I've had in a long time and this is McDonald's I think it's purely because of the fact that I love chicken selects so it's just heaven to me right now of a mm, 10 I would honestly give that burger like a 8 or 9 it's actually really good I think it's one of the best burgers that I've had from McDonald's. I'm just getting ready because tonight I'm off out for dinner in Mayfair. Um, I'm meeting three of my girlfriends and we're doing a secret Santa. This is going to be my second secret Santa this December and yeah I've just finished doing my makeup and just need to put my contact lenses in but I am ready and I'm really loving wearing red lipstick. I haven't worn red lipstick in a long time. She doesn't like it, Aiden. Just leave her alone. She doesn't want to put it on. She wants to go to sleep. Yeah. Just using my Bumble and Bumble uh, dry spun finish. This is really good for getting um, some texture. Texture. Yeah, texture to the hair. Sorry. 
E. Dirty? Yeah. What's dirty? Oh uh, yeah, I can't see. You can't see? Boo! Boo! Boo, boo, boo! Look at your hair! Boo. Oh, that's mummy's hair and your hair. Boo! 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 Copy went to the groomers earlier and oh, she looks. Ooh. Thank you, Copy. She looks really small and skinny now because uh, they clipped her hair off because it was. Careful! Um, because it was a bit long and. Bam. Yeah. But she looks nice and clean now. Mm. We just arrived outside my friend's house. Um, I don't know if she's seen my message. I don't think she has. Um, but I'm outside waiting and I really need her toilet but I can't park here because I'm on a single yellow so I need her to come out so I can go to the toilet while she looks after my car. Um, yeah. Let's see if she hears that. I didn't have time to paint my nails. I haven't painted my nails in years. Like it's not a priority to me now like have, before I would never ever have gone without painting my nails but right now I just not bothered come in I've decided to drive into Mayfair today because it's a Friday night and it's not that busy to be honest um my um regret that afterwards because it is near Christmas time but there's generally quite a lot of parking around Mayfair so I'm gonna drive in and after half past six um, the spaces are free and you can also park on single yellow as well so that's okay oh her little kids are waving at me <laughs> I said he wants to put his backpack on. He never likes it on his back. So I'm not sure what's got into him. Can you show everyone your backpack? Turn around. Woohoo! Who's a cutie? Are you a cutie? Yes. You are? Yes. <laughs> Where are we going? Yay! See Grandma and Grandad. All packed. Just need to go grab my car and then we're ready to go. Look at this, these guys. Coffee? Eden, that's too long. That's too long. Coffee's got um a little jump on because it's really cold outside and she's shaved, so <laughs> you two are cute. Go, let's see how long it's gonna take in um Google Maps. Oh, uh, three hours and 32 minutes drive. So with a stop for about half an hour, 45 minutes, just uh, four hours. Let's hope the traffic doesn't change. It's a cold day then. It's really cold here, isn't it? It's actually freezing. <laughs> I've got my leggings, Converse, and my thick fur coat on. Just waiting for this little guy's happy meal. I have my coffee. He's waiting for his happy meal and yeah there's quite a lot of people so it's gonna be a while I think. Oh it's still gonna be still gonna be one hour 55 minutes so let's get going and this is why I hate wearing glasses. Look guys it literally takes off half of my makeup on my nose so if I'm gonna wear glasses then I need to commit to wearing them all day long. I'm in my mum and dad's bathroom just unpacking some of my stuff and if I quickly just tell you about a couple of things that I cannot be without like a lot of these things I feel like are replaceable but there's a few things that I'm just like no I have to bring this with me and the first thing is the Foria I always always have this it's a bit grubby because I use it so much but it is very um, good at cleaning the skin. Second thing is the main until detangler. I never brush my wet hair 
without this in my hair because it just makes it so much easier and all my knots and um, tangles just come straight out. The Hero product for me is the Bumble and Bumble Invisible Oil. As you can see I've used like half of it nearly. It's just my hair oil of choice for the past two or three months and it works really well. So I'm pretty impressed with that. This is actually Aiden's. This is <laughs> this is Aiden's hair wax. He uses the Lee Stafford messed up. I know a lot of people um, sometimes ask me what I use to style his hair, and my camera's not focusing for some reason. Um, some more things I can't live without my blackhead peeling mask you guys know that i love this i always go on about it it is actually just amazing i'll be doing one of those tonight i think um ole um beauty fluid always in my kit or when i'm traveling what else have i got in here um this is actually really good this is elemis Pro collagen cleansing balm this is a travel sized one so i thought that it was perfect for bringing with me for skincare i brought two things this is the ordinary buffet and kiehl's midnight recovery concentrate these two in conjunction together are really good it really helps my skin especially now that it's really dry um thanks to all of the radiators 